I think it's fair to say that there are two sorts of people on this planet. Those that love Bollinger Champagne and those that don't. Uh, or rather you could say those that are right and those that are, are wrong. Um, because I'm a massive Bollinger fan. Um, every time I finish writing a book, I reward myself by buying myself a bottle of Bollinger's RD, which is the really super prestige wine that they make. Um, and of course, because I'm such a fan, I've been down to Bollinger many, many times. And it's when you go there that you find out why these wines are so important. Uh, Bollinger's based in a village called Ai, literally A-Y, uh, which is the stronghold of the Pinot Noir grape variety in the Mont and around Saint Champagne. It's literally the prime site. And they have amazing vineyards there, as you'd expect. They make um, a fabulous non-vintage champagne, which is the drunk by millions of people and a complete favorite. Um, not least, James Bond loves it, which is always cool. Um, but above that, the vintage wines are where the action really, really happens. And their vintage champagne called La Grande Anne is an absolute icon. Um, it's flattering in its youth, it's delicious and toasty and rich because there's so much Pinot Noir in the blend, but also they age forever as well. Um, above that, the RD that I spoke about a few minutes ago, um, that means récemment dégorgé, or late uh, disgorged. They basically keep the champagne in the cellar for ages and ages and ages, and then just flick the yeast out, shove a cap on, and then bring it into the market when it's mature, and that's why it's so heavenly because they've done the cellaring for you rather than you having to do it at home. Can you believe it? Above that is one more champagne, which I have to admit, I've only drunk twice in my life. Um, it's called La Vieille Vigne Francaise. And La Vieille Vigne Francaise is a wine that comes from two tiny little plots of land, two walled vineyards, right next to Bollinger's house in the middle of Ai. And these vineyards have never ever been grafted. So that means they're on their original roots, very, very old. They didn't suffer from the phylloxera bug which decimated all of France's vines in the 1850s. They basically are sitting on their own roots and they basically are spectacularly old. The wine that comes from these vines is one of the greatest in the world. Hence the fact I've only had a go twice. And I can assure you that it's worth every single penny. So, when you're out shopping for champagne and you haven't got a clue what to buy, I suggest you go to Bollinger.